we are a little late, but we are back. Last night's episode of The Mad Singer was a really great episode. This season is getting more and more tough as time goes on. It's difficult. Yes, it's getting very Hi. difficult. Like I said previously, this season is one of the seasons where like the two groups that we've seen so far, which is group A and group B, I haven't really had a whole bunch of guesses for either. I mean, the only obvious one was Busta Rhymes. Everyone else, I'm like, I don't know. I think I know a couple of people. Well, yeah, she she's kind of on yeah, it, but yeah. you know, I, I'm, I'm no, just, yeah. I'm not getting it this season. I'm not, but I'd like that challenge. So to start off last night was the popcorn. And honestly, I don't remember having a guess for this one. I don't believe I had a guess for popcorn and we could both agree that we didn't feel like the popcorn was Mary J. Blige, which is what Nicole had said previously. And after hearing the popcorn last night, yeah, that's not Mary J. Blige. But I feel like I know who the popcorn is. I feel like it's Cindy Lauper. Oh yeah, Cindy Lauper. And I didn't know who, I just couldn't put her name with her face, but I actually do know who Cindy Lauper is. And I'm not really familiar with her voice, but um, I, I feel like that's a good guess. And um, didn't somebody mention her last night, Cindy Lauper? Mm -hmm. Okay, so Cindy Lauper, is that you behind the popcorn? Up next was the giraffe and the person to be revealed. And I felt like I was so close with this one. Like, this was one of those people where when you hear his voice, it sounds so familiar. And as the judges were guessing, who was it that gave all the clues and, and you know, basically settled with Shia LaBeouf? It was Nicole. Nicole, and I was with Nicole. Everything she said, I was like, yes. I was too. Yes, yes. So when we got to the reveal of the giraffe, which I knew the giraffe was going home, I was confident in feeling like the giraffe was gonna be Shia LaBeouf. But when that mask got taken off, I was like, <gasps> I don't know who this is. I was so weak because I knew who it was. I did. I had no idea who that was. But it wasn't Shia LaBeouf. It was Brian Austin Green from 90210. 90210, a show that I actually have never watched before. So <laughs> I wasn't gonna get Brian Austin Green, but I did enjoy his character and his performances. Hi, he did a good job. Up next to perform were the Snow Owls, and honestly, this week, they sound more familiar than when we last heard them. But I still don't quite know who it is. They sound like older people, though. I feel the total opposite. This week, I don't have a clue. I know you don't still think it's um Nick Lachey and Jessica Simpson. That's what I'm saying. Last week, I had an idea. This week, it's more who, who. <laughs> Yeah, but they, they sound good. I like the way they, they had their little um coordinated dance together. I thought it was really cute. It, now, it takes away from the creepiness of the costume. Now, I agree with you. They do sound older. Yeah, they sound older for sure. It's older people. And the voices sound familiar, but not familiar enough for me to put a face with the voice. I felt like when I heard them perform, if they would have sang a little longer, something might have clicked, but... And the final performer tonight was The Sun. I completely changed my mind last night with hearing The Sun's voice. I believe it was Jenny who said it last, but I agreed with her when she said that Demi Lovato may be behind the mask of The Sun. And then last night, she made a reference to one of Demi Lovato's shows on Disney Channel, which is Sunny with a Chance, which I watched all the time. It's like when I hear The Sun sing, it sounds like just a little bit more of a mature voice. And Demi Lovato definitely is older, but not as old as the voice sound. But then I'm like, we seen that little Disney Channel symbol, so I don't know. I don't know. So I'm going with Demi Lovato, but I'm not going with Demi Lovato. I don't know. We are just not able to put exact faces with voices and sometimes we can't even make a guess because we just sit there and we basically have our ears on the television like <sighs> so yes guys those are all of our guesses for last night's episode if you guys have any ideas or answers to who you feel like are behind the mask of these performers please let us know because we are stuck this season and we usually are on it we usually can up oh, we know it up oh, we got it but i'm not stumped but i am having a little difficulty 
cheese sauce too. We're gonna go ahead and close this video out here. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe if you are new, and if you aren't new, welcome back. Thank you for coming back. And we will see you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.